Hey y'all, it's Small Town Needleworks, and I'm Kim. I'm Jade. Hello. Welcome back. Welcome if you're new. We're glad to have you here. Um, it is episode 25. Yes, Floss 2. Floss 2, episode 25. Number 25. Yep. It's the good old days. <laughs> glad to be back again with you guys. Um, we have... An exciting announcement at the end of the video. <laughs> at the end? Are we yep. sure it's going to make it to the end? It might. It might not. I don't know. <laughs> we'll see. So, um, stay tuned to the end. Um, let's see. What went on this week? Anything? Just busy. We got a little happy mail. We did. We got... Um, Today. Yep. We got some happy mail. You want to show them the front? Yep. So, we got... Don't show... Oh, I was like, don't show them the address. I thought you were <laughs> No, ours is fine. <laughs> oh, oh, God, we're a mess. We're a mess. It's, a, it's a thank you card um, from one of our beloved viewers. <laughs> one of our OGs and our consistents. But um, we had... And we had the pleasure of meeting her. Exchanged, I guess, or something, sort of. Uh, sort of. Sort of like a gift exchange. Um, <laughs> it wasn't so, intentional. But. Yeah. And then she sent us a thank you card. Thank you. She did. Thank, thank you. you. Show them the front of the card. That's what I meant. Oh. <laughs> it's, it's precious moments. And it's so cute. So cute. It is cute. Thanks. Thank you so much. much. We just, we, we're gonna record this video about an hour ago. <laughs> And then my dad came in and said, hey, Small Town Needleworks has uh, something, something at the post, at the post office. office. And so, we're like, we don't ever get things at the post office. <laughs> so we rushed to Especially the post office. Especially unexpected things. Yeah. <laughs> so that was nice. So we went to the post office before we did the video so that we could see what it was. Yep. And thank you. For yes. The thank you card. Yes. Very nice. Um, we're, it's probably going to be a quicker video today. Probably. You've got... <laughs> Some other happy mail too. I so did. Um, some haul. I got my Weeks Dye Works Floss Frenzy Club from Fat Quarter Shop. And this time it's called Cool Blue. I'll take them out so you can see them better. Those are pretty. I love blue. And that's what the packaging looks like. And the colors. Hey, that's a bird. What's a bird? Oh, yep, it is. <laughs> that's smart. Those are so pretty. I love them. This one's variegated. Like, more variegated mm -hmm. than others. All right. Read all the beautiful blues. <laughs> They're so pretty. Our, uh, our design board is just <laughs> catching all the lints. And not to mention, my cat gets up here and sits on it and lays down on it like it's its blanket. Man, her both apparently, was it yesterday? Yep. We were both cutting our fabric in our own respective houses with our own respective cats. <laughs> and I turned around for about two minutes to change a Netflix show, and I turned around and... There's my cat sitting on top of my fabric that I was cutting. I was like, well, I guess I'm done cutting that. And then she sends me a picture because <laughs> I sent her a picture. And her cat was sitting on her sewing table where she was cutting fabric. On my batting. Mm -hmm. On your batting. Maybe Jake can post, uh, insert the pictures. <laughs> I will try my best. Um, so we've got Americana, it's the darkest one, Blue Bonnet, Blue Coat Blue, Blue Coat Blue, <laughs> yes, I read that right, 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 can't see, can't turn my head that far, yeah, it is Blue Coat Blue, Union Blue, is here. It's the more variegated one. Um, and then this one is Blue Heron, which I said, hey, that's a bird. I'm smarticles. Smarticles. <laughs> and then this is Morris Blue. I know. 
I like it. It's real bright. I like them all. Very pretty colors. They are. That's all of my haul slash happy mail this week. I didn't didn't get too much, which is which is cool. I need to I need to slow down. You dig it. I got a couple other things on their way though. Yeah, you have grab some fabric or something. What you used? It. Oh yeah, I did get fabric, but You'll I've see, used it. Maybe. You'll see some of it. Um, the only thing that I got in the mail really was um, these guys. I had to reorder some thimble pads. They're like uh, leather, I think. Yeah, real leather, obviously. So it's real leather. But um, when we went to our retreat in Octo October, right? Yes. Um, she told me that Priscilla and Chelsea, or no, just Chelsea. Chelsea. Chelsea has to use the, the thimble things. And I was having, at that point, I had like sore or almost like I, it was just so sore I couldn't hardly touch my finger, my middle finger. Well, um, oh, I can't remember her name. Do you remember the name of the lady that gave me one? I don't remember who gave it to you. I remember the face. Did she sit at our table? No, she sat with Priscilla. I don't remember. She gave us the giveaway of the tissue packet thing. Oh, we're terrible. Crafty Karen? No. No. Nope, that was a different one. table. Barbara Johns? No. That nope. was a different table. Holy moly. <laughs> Anyways, if I can figure out who she was, I would like to thank her as well because she gave me one and I probably used that one for like two weeks. They're reusable, they re stick. So I just stick them back to the pad. But this is my second box <laughs> since October that I've went through. Or, well, this is my second box I've had to order. But these have saved my finger, my life, my finger's life. <laughs> I just wanted to, if anybody has any issues with it getting sore or anything like that, like, I'll, the way I stitch, I push through with my middle, this middle finger. And it gets, like, tender and not raw, but it'll get dried out and red. Not with these bad boys. I can't stitch without them now, pretty much. I got down to like two and I was like, I gotta get some more. <laughs> so that's my happy mail. And I can link that Amazon if if y'all want to get y'all some to try out. Those are the best though, cause they're not stiff. The other ones were like plasticky and I didn't really like those. But these are leather, so they it helps like hold the thread and everything. It's good. Good. Um, what else? Should we do these first? Sure. You go. Okay. <laughs> so I have three whips this week. I only have one. I'm sorry. Sorta. I only have one cross stitch whip. Yeah, she's been stitching by other means. <laughs> <laughs> she's been hard at work. So, um, you know. I have like a million projects, probably not the most, but I decided to start another new one last week. <laughs> um, so it is a dimensions kit. Uh, picked it up, I think, at Hobby Lobby. I don't know. I really like llamas. So I got this. No it's problem. Cute. That one's for yourself, right? Yes. <laughs> It's going to be done, though, a lot sooner than probably some of the other ones that are for myself. <laughs> because you'll see. Aw. It's so cute. You don't have very much left. No, I have backstitch, one color, and then that color. Wow. Yeah, so I did all this in, like, one setting. Hmm, maybe. It's very cute. It's much cuter than the pictures. Oh, look at it. <laughs> I love it. So, pretty much all I have left to do is I gotta fill in with another cream color all the way up to the neck. I think I, yeah, I started at the head. So, I'll just go down here. And then, no problem. And then the back stitch, and I'll be done. That's cute. Everything always looks so much better actually stitched than it does in the pictures, I think. Yeah. 
I like it. And this one even came with this. I don't know if I'll use it or not, but I might to hang it up somewhere. We'll see. <laughs> Probably not. <laughs> but it came with it. You may do my one. Sure. I only work I only worked on one. I promise I'm gonna do more cross stitching guys, but we've been busy. Or I've been busy doing other things. I mean I've been busy too, just not with yes. what she, she has maybe. school. But I only worked on my January calendar crate. Um from Stitching with the Housewives. And I did the other big snowman on this side and then the truck with the snowman in it right here. That's cute. So, all I have left are the snowflakes on top. Which is, can they see it? Yep. <laughs> That's all I have left, and it'll be done. I love it. I think it's really cute. Oh, excuse me. Hold on, I can my... I just zipped my bag back up before I put my stuff in it, because I thought it was zipped. Mercy. This one so you guys can see all of it. Oh, I did right here, but. Oh, that's cute though. So, this is my Country Cottage Needleworks Forest Banner. It's from the Welcome to the Forest series. It's so cute. I love those colors. They look so springy. I know, that's why I wanted to do it. So, I, um, I don't think I got much done other than I worked on uh, these two little letters and maybe this one. I can't remember if I had this one done last. I didn't do much on it, but, I mean, progress is progress. And this is on the 14 count wood uh, <laughs> fabric flare from Fat Quarter Shop. <clears throat> you gonna do your other one or yes okay and this is another dimensions kit that I've been working on it's my Cinderella for me Madre <laughs> <laughs> all those colors are it looks really dark on this paper I mean, they are a little bit darker, but even, it just, it don't look right. It don't, <laughs> the colors don't match. It doesn't do look, it justice. Yeah, that. <laughs> so pretty. So, I worked last night, I had to redo a, some of the gold and yellow over here. Um, so, I had taken that out, redid it, uh, did all this gold here. There's a little blue here, uh, and this little top part of the gold, and this, this coin over here. Oh. I think it's pretty. I love it. I need to look up that, um, somebody suggested some not be they said beeswax in the same comment oh yeah they said i something forgot what that condition. was called. yeah condition. thread conditioning thread conditioner, conditioner. Er, question mark. i'm gonna look that up though because this metallic is like impossible <laughs> to deal with not impossible obviously i've done it it's just not fun it's not fun <laughs> i mean it feels cool sort of feels know. cool or feels different feels different. It's not <laughs> soft. It's rough. I like the way it looks. Yeah, I do too. Yeah. It's pretty. Close. I love it. I got a way long time to go on this one though. Not, 
I'm not in a hurry. It's not like a long time, but like once I get done, there's a lot of back stitching on this guy. Yeah, so. I think back stitching goes faster though than cross stitching, but that's just it me. does. But it's just kind of tedious, I guess. That, ugh. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. But anywho, that's all my whips. Um, I have. Of course, the loudest car in the neighborhood decides to start up. If you hear a motor, that's what it is. Our loud car neighbors. It's her young neighbor that she's never liked. I like him. He's a sweet boy, but oh my God, he's always just loud. You know, Loud cars, loud mouth. Loud fireworks, <laughs> loud guns. Anything that he can do to be loud, he he's going to do it. Uh subdivision in the middle of nowhere and of course anything that's loud is it's louder mm -hmm. than the usual traffic and it seems to always be in the inopportune times <laughs> so anyways so um i'm gonna show you guys these because they're not fully finished yet but they are technically whips sewing whips but they are our large <laughs> it sounds like a bumblebee <laughs> they are our large cross stitch clutch and i still have to put the snaps on and our labels before the snaps and before the fold <laughs> yeah this is before the fold before the snaps um but i just wanted to show you guys some of the stuff that was coming up in the etsy shop so anyway, here's this one. I'll just show them quickly. I know you've seen this fabric before, but that's one. And this is a new fabric I haven't showed you guys. This is one that she got at the Wally Worlds, I think, the other day. Yep. Part of her haul. -ish. But it's got all kinds of sewing Do notions it. and stuff on it. But there's that. And here's another one. It just has a different inside. And again, for those of you that didn't see the last video, they close over like this and they have two snaps, one on each side. So. And there's another one with a different inside. And one more. So, some of these uh, are going to be in with, they're going to be sold with project bags as sets, but some of them are going to be sold separately because we had several people after the last video ask if we were going to sell the large clutch um, on its own. So, I made made and am making more um large uh clutches to sell separately so there may not be a ton right off the bat because i just started doing it uh, a couple days ago so here's another one it's just yellow polka dot and here's another one that's just a king green girl. color you ever heard of one what polka dot king girl Maybe. Yellow polka, yellow. I've polka heard of the dot. old, old, old song. Yellow polka dot bikini that she wore for the first time today. It's like a, well, I don't know, maybe sixties. Um, yeah, that's the song I'm referring to. Really? Yes. <laughs> How do you even know that song? She always is surprised that I know these songs, <laughs> like way out of my age range, I guess. Yes, that's right. <laughs> that's. That's the song I was referring okay. to. Okay. All right. Then, yes, I've heard of it. <laughs> I figured you were talking about some newfangled polka dot song. No. <laughs> I don't think anybody's done a newfangled polka Here's dot. Here's that one. And then here is a St. Patty's. Yay. Um, <clears throat> in the shop, there will be these two coordinating project bags. project bags made out of these two i just have not finished those yet 
and this is also the coordinating project bag that's coming with these two colors. I will also have those. Are there any more? Can't remember. And then I have, um, oh, mercy. I have some small clutches also. Um, I think three more that I'm working on. And then I have this one small clutch that I finished. And it's a small one, not a large like what I just showed you. For size reference. Um, but that's what it looks like. <laughs> I like it. And so, she did do the... I did do the tag, the, what do you call it? Labels on the end. That's what I decided on. And then I have, you want to go with your finish first? Oh, sure. <laughs> She's done all this. <laughs> <laughs> this is what I did. <laughs> this is the only one that I've made. We just had to, in a while. I just had to put the label on it and crochet a, um, zipper pull but this was um this fabric was given to me by my my grandmother um she had a she had like loads and loads and loads of older fabrics that she got like basically wholesale when this plant shut down um it's very cute and then this one if you like lobsters yeah <laughs> And I thought it was fun, so it is fun. At this lobsters, I got um was clearance at Walmart. So it's cute. It goes well together. Yeah, I've got some more, some other ones cut out that I'm making as well. Um, I don't know if they will be done in time, but I'm going to try because Mom's been working hard and I've been slacking. Well, I've got more time than you do. Yeah. Well, and she gets up earlier than I do. I like my sleep. Well, my cat won't let me sleep late. Oh, mine, mine is asleep in the bed when I get up really He got me late. up at 4.30 a.m. yesterday morning. He will not stop. It's like a toddler. Just pecking on your shoulder. And if that doesn't work, then he gets on my nightstand <clears throat> the last two nights in a row, I haven't even told you this. I have a slide thing on the back of my phone. What's that called? A pop, the pop socket. Oh, it's like thing. this. It slides off, and I take it off at night to put it on its charger. And I lay it behind my bottle of water that I keep on my nightstand. And the remote up against it so he doesn't get it. For well, the last two nights, I have walked to the bathroom and when I come back from the bathroom, I stepped on something and I was like, what is that? <laughs> and it was the back of my, it was my pop socket off the back of my phone. So he gets up on my nightstand and thieves that and carries it down in front of the bed. He will knock over my water bottle. He'll knock stuff off the nightstand, the remote. He knocked that off this morning at 430. If that doesn't work, then he gets into my trash can that I keep beside the bed and turns it over. He's like, hello, I want you up. What do you not get? <laughs> oh, for him to go find somewhere to go back to Yes, sleep. and then I get and then I give up. I get up and then I'm like 30 minutes ago was a bye, and I'm like, where is he? And he'll be in my bed. My 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 Cora, my cat, one of my cats. Nubby has nothing to do with us really. Cora, when I get up. It don't matter what time I get up, I, if it's noon or 11 or 10, or if I get up at four for some god awful reason, she's still in my bed when I get up. She might move around, but she is still in the bed asleep. <laughs> <laughs> she likes the bed. She goes from one bed, my bed, to my guest bed and back and forth and is asleep like all the time. <laughs> so. Anywho, back to the finishes. Um, these bags that I'm going to show will be sold uh, without um, clutches. Without clutches. They'll be uh, sold alone. But there's that one. 
so pretty. I love the blue. It's just solid blue back. And again, if you uh, missed our last video, these will be sold in our Etsy shop. Uh, and every project bag will come with a uh, crocheted zipper pull. Then I have another one that's just exactly like that one, except for it's a, that one has a red zipper and this one has a green zipper. You lied. Did I? Yep. What's different? The top of the zipper. Oh, my bad. It's almost the same. It's almost the same. I just like picking on her. Yeah. The, the other project bag has blue right yeah, here Yeah, it's as blue well. and blue, but this one is blue and then the flowers on top. But they all match. <laughs> And then I have another blue, but it's a different um, pattern in the middle. This, Those I just showed are um, the floral is Pioneer Woman, and this is also Pioneer Woman as well. And this is also Pioneer this Woman. really pretty. It's a pale blue. The blue doesn't show up. It's true color on the camera. Uh, but it is, it's very, very pretty. And it's like a cream color, and uh, it's a cream colored zipper pull. And then one more. And it's the same as the other one, except for this print. So pretty. In the back. And both of these uh, colors are Pioneer Woman. So... Ooh, That's me. all I have to show you today, but like I said, I have several more uh, project bags that will be coming. I don't know if I'll have them in the shop when we open or not. Um, yeah, it's the same. So same for mine. I have some cut out, but but um, anyway, our big announcement we decided when we're opening our etsy shop <laughs> we are going to open our etsy shop when you're watching this if you watch it on friday when it comes out we're opening our etsy shop on saturday at 4 p.m at 4 p.m central time when this video premieres 24 hours from then saturday february the 12th at 4 p.m. Central Standard Time. Yes. So, if, if all goes well. Yeah. Yes. If all goes well and we get everything loaded that's correctly, that's our goal. So, <laughs> we're about to tackle that beast here in just a moment. Yep. Um, we'll also be announcing at the same time this video goes out, we'll put something out on Instagram and Facebook. Uh, so, if you, you know, miss. If you don't see the video right away, it'll be on Instagram as well. So, yep. I'm sure um, if you've gotten to this point, you've either seen it. <laughs> on Instagram or you're seeing it here so right right um so if you guys are interested um it is it is small town needleworks correct it we haven't it will it be, should be should be small town needleworks the way you have to open your shop you have to list something first to like secure the name so if, if unless somebody randomly chose small town needleworks it wasn't taken before so we're hoping you know that it still will be if for some odd reason we have to come up with a different name or change it up a little bit we will uh post that on instagram and facebook and then up you get at the youtube community update, update. <laughs> Update. Yeah, we'll update you <laughs> next week, okay? So, but hopefully all goes well in our Etsy shop. It will be called, look how dark it is where the sun uh, is shining off kilter. Um, but sun's going down. It so should be under spot. Small Town Needleworks on Etsy. So go check it out and see what all we'll have available. And we're excited. We can't wait to. Get some of our creations into your hands. Yes. And uh, we thank you guys for your support and your ideas. Keep them coming. Um, because, you know, we may, we may do other things uh, along the way, try new things. So, but for now. I'm hoping during the summer I can yep. be able to 
do more for y'all too. Yep. So. But for now, we have the one size project bag. Um, two size clutches. Two size clutches. Some will be sold in sets and some will be sold separately. And that goes for all three items. Um, <clears throat> so well, these will be sold separately. True. The small the clutches, small clutches will, always will always be sold be separate. separately. If there is a, a matching clutch uh, set with the bag, it'll be a large clutch. So, um, at least that's the goal. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Things always change. Yeah, I mean supply and demands. Yes, walking. that's the goal. We're open, open to it. But um, we're excited. Thanks again for that. Um, wanted to give a shout out this week to another uh, under 1,000 subscribers. And it is the Cross Stitch Farmhouse. And her name is Kelsey. So go over and check her out. Let her know that we got, oh, uh, we guys. <laughs> you guys came from us. <laughs> yeah. I think that's where she was going. Yeah, something like that. <laughs> Let we her know you. that we sent you. <laughs> <laughs> and check out her channel. Um, she has two videos. Um, I think maybe she does it once a month. So far, it looks like that's what she's doing. So, but check her out. Give her some love. And then Jade's going to talk about giveaways. I mean, we finally, because <laughs> we've slacked and then COVID and slacked some more, finally sent out the Q-Snap and the last uh, spring pattern that we gave away, we sent those out today when we went to the post office. Right. Um, so those should get to you fairly soon. I'm not sure how long it takes to get to Canada, but it'll the, be there. Yep, the Q-Snap went to Canada. It's our yeah. first international. Um, so it, it might, it's on its way. So, just be on the lookout for it, you know, who you are. <laughs> so, um, today we're going to give this guy away. It is the Madam... Madam... <laughs> we can't talk today. <laughs> Madame Chantilly. Uh, celebrate Easter uh, pattern. And I think that's... What, what are those called? The tear tray. Tear tray. Yeah. That. <laughs> tear tray. Very... Cute. And this was provided to us from our anonymous stitchy friend. Yes. And we appreciate it so, so, so much. She has provided us with a lot of giveaways. And, and we, we are very thankful for that. Lots of advice. Oh, my goodness. She's so smart. Yeah. She's very smart. And we listen to a lot of ideas that I'm she's terrible. given us. I'm terrible. I haven't responded to the email. The Which last, one? The last one. Well, you should get on I'm it. I'm so sorry. I'll do that. <laughs> Hopefully, you'll see an email before you see this. I'm sorry. I'll get back to you, though. <laughs> but, yes, she's very smart and helped us a lot. And we've kind of cleared up some questions, I guess, that she's didn't even know we needed to ask, really, I guess. <laughs> but, anyways. So, if you would like to win this pattern, Madam Chantilly's Celebrate Easter, um... comment Easter <laughs> or tell us what you like about Easter. Just use the word Easter, Easter in your comment. Yes. If you're interested in winning it. Any way, shape, form, or fashion as long as it's Easter. Yes. Be 18 years of older. Or of older. Oh God, help me. <laughs> I can't talk. <laughs> of or it's like they both have two letters. Can't, can't make it through one video. What can't was I trying to say? <laughs> you must be 18 years. Must be 18 years. years of, <laughs> I was trying to say it and you messed me up. Of older? Yeah, you messed me up. No, don't blame it on me. I ain't blaming it on you. <laughs> 18 years or older. Yes, so we can answer, ask for your so address. We can ask for your address, obviously, because we're going to send it to Please you. Please like you. and subscribe if you haven't already. Share the video with your friends if you think they might be interested. We appreciate you all. Tell them we're a bunch of cuckoos <laughs> and cocoa puffs over here. We appreciate you all so much for continuing to support us and to 
come back and watch us every week. We're we get excited we're very thankful to share with you guys. So yes, <laughs> we're glad to have this community. Yes, and um, we will see you guys next week, and we hope. <laughs> Was that a Bible? Oh, no. Well, you're taking... I didn't know where you were going. <laughs> we hope to see you guys in our Etsy shop. Yes. Uh, doing a little shopping. Um, if you're interested or if you're if in you're the not, market. It's fine. If you're not, we're still glad you're here. And we appreciate you watching us. Thanks again. And we will see you guys next week. Bye. Bye. <laughs>